lads and ladies and welcome to this now today i am back with another video and i am buzzing my team fleetwood have set today signed striker chad evans not on a loan deal not on a free permanently on a six figure substantial fee what a signing we had him on loan last year he played 41 times for us in the league he scored 18 goals Average 2.65 shots on target a game. Um, the only one doubtful I have with him is his aerial ability. He only won 0.28% of aerial duels, which isn't great. But like I say, he works hard. His touchdowns are excellent. Scores goals. Got a good penalty, good composure. And he's such a good player to have in this league. Especially to the players that we've already got. He knows Paul Coote. He knows Paddy Madden. He knows the squad of last year. And he knows a lot of players that have come in. Obviously played with uh, Paul Coote at Sheffield United. And he's just a great deal. He scores goals. He adds something different. He holds the ball up. Something that we've always needed. Um, to, to beat off Bolton, Shrewsbury uh, for his signing is such a good intent. He only wanted to come back to Fleetwood, he said. Um, so it's a great bit of business. Obviously, the 18 goals last year, uh, seven was pens, 11 in open play. Um, but like I say, he's such a great player, so it adds so much and offers so much more than goals. Um, he links up well with Hunter, Wes Burns, Paddy Madden, which are very good players at this level. We have also signed uh, Peter Clock and Matt Jukes. I haven't done videos for them yet, but I'll talk of them in this video, obviously. Experienced pros, know League One, League Two, the Championship very well. Obviously, Jukes played at Blackpool, Scunthorpe, Lincoln. Oldham, Burnley, Rangers, he's been everywhere recently, um, now at Fleetwood 37, same with Peter Clark, been at Oldham, Blackpool, Huddersfield, um, Berry. so he's done well to get experience, so good signs as well as Ched, but at number nine, get the ball to him and he'll score, um, hopefully, hopefully he can have a good spell, obviously Barton knows how to get the best out of him, hopefully um, if a club doesn't come in for him, um, he doesn't get a bit upset about it, which he didn't last year. When Bolton came in for him, he carried on playing football and scoring goals. That's what he was great at. And that's why I love him. He's got a great attitude. Obviously, people think, uh, obviously, with the incident that happened a few years ago. But for me, he's innocent. When proven innocent, that's it. That's the end of it. People need to get over it. Uh, let's see, let, let the lads focus on his football. He had four years out of football, which he shouldn't have had. Obviously, he's had spells at Chesterfield, Sheffield United uh, in the past. And obviously, Fleet was the place where he started scoring goals again. He started firing on all cylinders. Um, he gets into spaces, he gets into places where he can score goals and explore himself, which is such a good player to have and such a good trait to have. Um, obviously, the fans know him, love him. He, he respects the fans, obviously. Um, obviously, the only problem is his back. He has got a bad back at the moment. So he, he did apparently fail a medical at Bristol Rovers. Um, we was going to be interested in Cole and Lavery, but we went for Ched instead. And Lavery's actually gone to Walsall now in League Two. Um, but we've got a lot of Sheffield United fans now, so um, woohoo as, as their second team. Um, but honestly, this signing can easily get us into the playoffs for me. Um, with the signing of Paul Cooch, Josh Morris, Matt Jilks, Peter Clark, Jordan Rossiter, Louis Coyle. Harry Souter, um, Danny Andrew, they're all very good signings at this level and can easily, easily push up a few divisions. Um, let's just hope Ched gets off to a good start, obviously. We do play Wimbledon um, at home on Saturday in Doncaster away where he scored last year a penalty. So hopefully, um, I don't think he'll get as many goals as last year because a lot were penned and a lot were tappings, but I'm hoping, obviously he's you got to be in the right place at the right time to score them. But thank you for watching today's video. I hope you have enjoyed it. Please smash the like button in if you have. Uh, come and try and hit. Let's go for 50 likes on it. We are nearing and nearing 4,000 subscribers at the moment. And we are on the road to get there by the end of September. So if you can help us out, that'll mean the world. Obviously, football's back now, so loads of cool videos coming up on the channel. And like I say, hopefully it's going to be a start of a good year for Fleetwood, a start of a playoff push for us, and maybe even automatics if we're going to get excited. Let's get, like I say, let's get into a good season, and hopefully Ched can bang in at least 15 to 20 goals, which we all know 
which you can do. Thank you for watching, thank you for uh, liking, and I'll see you in the next video. Please remember to like, subscribe, peace out.